Hey everyone, and welcome to Front Bill's Twilight Princess Guide, Part 102. So as you can see with this area, just make sure you claw into the ceiling, take all the kills off the uh, weird pig creatures here. Sound. Oh, that's right. Um, so what you want to do is get as far away from the pigs as you can. Yeah, that's the sound there, the rats. Oh, I did an awful job of trying to stay away from them, but Oh, fine. Anyway, so after you kill everything in there, uh, get your spinner out, and drop down into this area right here to go into the next level. And here you see a very big, was it chew? It's chew. What you talking about, with this? What you talking about, Willis? What you talk about me? Sorry. Anyway, so um, yeah, just keep on uh, destroying the chews from a distance. I don't like calling them chews. It just sounds weird. I'm gonna call them blob. The blob. Anyone remember that old movie, The Blob? No, I've never seen it before, but I've seen like previews and pictures, of course, of it. But I really want to see that movie. Is it really? Does it suck? I don't know. Anyway, um, so after you destroy the gigantic chew, bog thing, uh, go to the next area, and you'll see. If you remember those little worm dudes with the bubbles. <laughs> um, of course, if you remember how to handle them, just. <laughs> Pull him out of the bubble. And attack. Remember, like I said, people, if you are having trouble or difficulty with the current level of this, um, you know, it is okay to use the magic armor if you need it. You should have it. Like I said, the magic armor uses up rubies, which allows you to, you know, save your hearts. But, uh, you don't have to use it if you don't want to. I don't think I did. I don't remember. We'll have to see. <laughs> I don't think I used it. Anyway, here. Fun thing. The flying skull. Usual thing. Jump to the side. And try to attract as few to you as you can at the time. <laughs> mm, well, that works. Mm. Alright. So happy to kill all those. Go down into the next level. Or... Yeah. Yeah, what I'm doing is trying to catch the attention of all these little dudes here. Crap. Like I said, don't need to waste your arrows right now. Just try to get them all bunched up together if you can. And you can kill them all at once. 
or well, a lot of them at once anyway. There are, uh, or it's where he's in this area. Oh, yeah. uh, I think this one is just the normal rats and bats. Rats and bats. <laughs> <coughs> Postal, but uh, before heading directly to it, jump off the side here. Uh, there's also these skeleton dogs here. Uh, uh, that is why, of course, it's good to jump off the side to try to not get the attention of the postal. Which apparently, didn't work for me that time. Oh well. I should still have more than enough parts to. Uh, I'm okay with this. So now you have the next puzzle. Sure you remember these little dudes here. Just wait until they get closer, do your spin attack, kill them off. Very easy. Uh, oh right, I think there was actually a dig spot here as well. Yeah, right underneath the uh, ledge, you can get a heart if you need it. Here you'll see some more uh, jelly things, and in the distance you'll see a glowing uh, blob, jelly, chew, thing. Um, now, of course, what you try to do is not to let the jellies uh, come together and to find the bigger jelly. Now there are a lot of them in this floor, and what you have to try to do is uh, not let the golden jelly merge with the other ones. You have to actually try to scoop it up if you can, which doesn't seem to work. I mean, which did happen to me anyway. Sucks, but oh well. And I didn't really need it anyway. And these things are getting freaking huge, so die, 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 die. Like I said, there can be quite a lot of these. Just be very careful. Oh, 
Okay, this is going to take a little bit, but I'm going to have to continue this in the next vid.